everybody, this is Sharon, and um, I want to share a little project here that I, um, I purchased at Michael's, and I said I was not going to um, jump on the bandwagon of the planners, but um, after they had them at Michael's, I just um, kind of fell in love with them, and they were, you know, a great price. So I wanted to really just show you some of the embellishments that I made, and um, so I'm going to pick my camera up so you guys can see how the top of it looks. It has like um, a bow right here, and then I did a little metal embellishment here, and then this is a little purse. And then um, the bow right here, I got that idea from Creative Kelly from Kelly. So thanks, Kelly, for that idea. I thought it was so pretty. Yours is a lot prettier than mine, but um, so I just did it with some ribbons. But um, let me set this back down. So I, I purchased the mint green one, and um, so I'll show you how it looks on the inside. I'm not going to show you how I, you know, have it laid out or anything like that because I have some personal things in here. But um, these are the little purse that I mostly wanted to share with you guys. And I can do a tutorial on those if you if you guys are interested. But um, so it just, uh, it looks like this right here. And um, all I did is just used a couple of um, punches that I have. And um, so that's the way it looks. And you just fold them in half. This right here is actually a shaker. And, um, but you can't really hardly tell it. And I probably won't do another one of these because they were kind of hard to do. And so then I just layered this little bow that I had in my stash. And then just some of this beaded trim across the top. And then the back of it doesn't look very pretty because this beaded trim does, um, you know, have some dimension to it. So it doesn't stick out. I mean, it sticks out and you can't really lay anything back on the back of it. And then this is another one with a different punch. Let me show you the difference. You can see the difference there. One's a little wider and one's a little bit taller than the other one. And I just did them with some different paper. Um, like I said, this is a punch. And then I did like a circle punch right here. And then, you know, just kind of embellished it with some laces and like these trims that I have. And I thought they turned out so cute. They're really cute once you get them in your planner. Um, I did some lace trim down here, and these are some crystals that I purchased at Michael's. And then I have some of the beaded trim and a little heart um, embellishment here. And then on this side over here, you might can see them a little bit better. This is the metal embellishment that I did. And then I have the other little purse here. And then uh, this is a um, doohickey die from Magnolia. So I'll put that there, and I'll take those down so you can see them. I just wanted you to see how they look when they were, um, you know, in the planner, how cute they look when they're layered up there. So this is this one. And all I did on this one right here, this is a metal piece from, um, oh gosh, I can't remember her name. I'll list it in the link below. But um, Butterby Scraps. And it was silver, and I just used this... Um, this pen that I got uh, from Walmart is called Deco Color Premium, and um, and I just colored the metal here, and then um, of course my paper clip was already gold. I picked that up at um, a Staples um, close to our town. Then I just did some flowers here, and this is one of the word beads from Michaels, and then I just did a couple of little charms and a pink bead here, and this is a little bone and um because i love you know animals and um so i put some gold um i used the same pen for that on the little uh, bone it was in a sterling silver and that's the way the back i just put um you know a little thing there on the back so i'm not really concerned you know the way the back looks this is just going to be my planner it's going to be in my craft room i don't take it anywhere with me so um i don't think you'll you know nobody will see the back of it nobody but me and so here's the other little purse I just thought they were so cute, and um, I thought you guys might would like a tutorial on them, if you don't mind the backs of them, you know, looking like that. And I took that pen and went around the gold pen here, and went around the bow, so I don't know if you can really even see it, but it's all the way around the edges on the bow there. So I thought they turned out really super cute. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I hope you guys are having a great Sunday, and um... If you are interested in the tutorial, just let me know and I will get that up for you guys. 
So I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.